Look how long this trail actually stays. Whoa. And it's still not gone. Look at this. Is it going to leave? Hmm, no way. Oh, there it goes. <laughs> wow, this trail is so cool. You are now watching James the Noob King. King, King. This is James the Noob King. If you haven't already, please do not forget to like and subscribe. What's up guys, and we are back for another exciting video. Today we're going to be playing Speed City, but also I'm going to be showing you guys how to get the best trail in Speed City. And if you don't know what the best trail in Speed City is, you definitely should. So obviously we just had a brand new update in Speed City, which also brought an amazing trail. Which also happens to be the best trail in Speed City, and it's this trail right here. And this trail is called the Not Free Orb, and it has a step multiplier 777, and an orb multiplier 777, and a jump multiplier 5. This trail is amazing compared to every other trail in Speed City. And obviously, this is my new favorite trail. So this trail is super cool, and I'm going to show you guys how to get this trail today. Woohoo! But first, let's see what this trail looks like. This is the Not Free Orb Trail, and it is definitely cool. I really don't think there are any other trails that are just like this trail. This trail is super unique. This trail also kind of follows you around, which obviously you want a trail to do. Look at this trail, it is just so cool. But how do you get this new trail? To find the new crate, you have to be in the starter area next to the fountain, and then you look for Elite City, which is right behind me. And right next to the Elite City, to the left, is the new crate. It's actually kind of hidden, and it's super small. This is actually the smallest crate I've ever seen. And it says not free on it, which, yeah, obviously if you're buying from a crate, it's not going to be free. And when you walk up to the not free crate, it actually asks you for 777,777,777 steps. Wow! That is a lot of steps, guys. If you do have this many steps, then you can buy from this crate. So this crate is definitely not free, and it comes at kind of a steep price, but if you have a lot of steps, then this is a great way to spend them because this new trail is definitely amazing. So a lot of people don't know where this crate is, and that's because it is kind of hidden. And if you can't visit Elite City, then you probably will never see this crate unless you watch this video. Let me know in the comments below if you guys know where the Not Free Crate is. Also, like always, don't forget to share this video. So like I said in my last video, this trail is super cool, and one reason for that is that it's kind of like the Timeless Trail. Look how long this trail actually stays. Whoa. And it's still not gone. Look at this. Is it going to leave? Hmm, no way. Oh, there it goes. <laughs> wow, this trail is so cool. So if you don't have this new trail yet, you definitely should get it if you have the steps. And as you can see right now, I actually have enough to buy from the Not Free Crate. I actually have 797,628,877 steps. And my speed is 9,044. This is just crazy. This is the most steps I've actually ever had. And that's basically thanks to this new trail. So using the Not Free Orb Trail and getting orbs in the Elite City is definitely a great combination because I get so many steps, I cannot even believe how many steps I actually get. So I definitely think that this new trail is worth it. Wow, James, you almost have as many steps as me! <laughs> um, yeah, Mr. Noob, I don't think you have any steps. <laughs> Alright guys, that's it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching, and thank you for making it this far. If you haven't already, please do not forget to like, subscribe, and share this video, and I will see you guys on the next video. Whoa! You're still here? Thanks for watching! See ya!